Hi, welcome to Igula Yupuna Global Outreach. I am Brother Hosanna David. This is a message the Lord gave to me on the 5th of January 2022 and 20th of January 2022. This is a message the Lord gave to me about the outbreak of autoimmune disease among those who have taken three or more shots of this. This C V. Those of you who are watching on YouTube, click the links in the description below. You can watch this message on Rumble, the uncensored version, on Rumble at Ego Layopuna and my Telegram channel, Ego Layopuna. In case you have not subscribed to my Rumble and Telegram channel, please subscribe to this channel so that you can get updates of our of uncensored messages. When I got this message, I didn't know how to actually deliver this message, so I just posted the message on my website, igolayupona.com. But on a second thought, I said, now that I have platforms where I can post raw truth, Rumble and Telegram, I said, okay, let me just do this video and see create the awareness so that people can know what is coming ahead of them. Please, in case you have not subscribed to this channel, please subscribe to this channel so that you can get updates whenever I post any video. Don't forget to turn on the notification bell. On the 5th of January 2022, I heard the words, autoimmune disease. I heard these words three times on two different occasions, autoimmune disease. After I heard these words, I was praying God, what are you trying to tell me? Are you trying to message me? Are you trying to give me any message? I prayed. I didn't get any answer until the 20th of January this year. The Lord spoke to me and told me the meaning of the words I had, autoimmune disease. The Holy Spirit spoke to me and told me that autoimmune disease would be among some of the people who took third dose or more doses, this C, V. He said, some of the people, I'm not saying all, I wasn't told all, all of them, all of the C, V are not the same. They, are, they have different compositions. So I'm not trying to tell you in any way that all of them are the same and anybody that takes it um, is going to have problem. That is not what I'm saying. People, many people know how to spread false information. That is not what I'm saying. But many of those who have taken three or more are going to have this medical challenge. Then I heard a voice that said, detox and unplug yourself. The C V is presented to people as a static Jesus that will take them nowhere. He said, detox and unplug yourself. Again, he said, detox and unplug yourself from the V program. It is a program. It is unending. When you start, you continue to take. As a matter of fact, they are saying that it wants to be Every six, six months, there is a plan. I posted a video yesterday, which is a divine revelation the Lord gave to me about mass death. This message is pointing directly to that message that the Lord gave to me. I am telling you, the one that has traveled to tomorrow, the one that knows the future told me and he also told me what people should do. Please watch the video that I posted before now. Unplug yourself from the program. For those of you who have taken one, two or more, please unplug yourself. I'm not trying to give you a medical advice. I'm only telling you that this is what God has revealed to me. 
Be careful so that you don't experiment with the precious life that God has given to you. I'm going to close the comment section of this video so that people don't post comments that we attract censorship. Please watch the full video, the uncensored version, on my Telegram and Rumble channels, Eagle Eye Opener. On the 1st of December 2021, I got another prophetic message where God talked about mass death and God's final mercy. If you have started, if you have plugged yourself to this program, please unplug yourself. Some people say there is no hope. But according to this message the Lord gave to me on the 1st of December 2021, I want to tell you that there is hope. There is hope. I'm going to do another video and talk about this hope. Those who have taken this thing, can they be saved? I want to tell you that yes, don't condemn yourself. Don't ever condemn yourself. I know even me, I have fought in the dream when they tried to inject me with this thing. I was ready to destroy the person that was bringing this needle to give me this poison. I was mad at the person in the dream. I was fighting with all my strength to make sure that I never took it. And the Lord told me to warn people, and I have been warning people. But the same me, I am telling you that do not take laws into your hands. Don't start living in sin because you feel somebody says that God said, once you took it, you are doomed forever. God is a merciful God. I'm not encouraging you to continue to take. In fact, this message is saying that stop taking. Unplug yourself. Stop. If you can't cope in your environment, change your environment. The Lord has told me this before, and I have said it several times. If you can't cope in your environment, change your environment. But don't touch your life. Don't touch your spiritual life. Don't touch your physical life. Because you are having guilt in your heart. Don't feel everything is over and that you must end it all. Don't plunk yourself into sin and start living in sin. If God has not told you, I have condemned you, you are doomed forever. If God has not told you and you have not confirmed that this is the voice of God condemning me while I am still alive, do not condemn yourself. God is a merciful God and I know his mercy is forevermore. In the previous video I posted on the, about the revelation of mass death, the Lord told me that a door of salvation is going to be opened for as many that want to be saved. I believe that message. God is using this opportunity of mass death and this autoimmune disease to call as many as he can to repentance so that it can be changed. Thank you for watching this message. Please share this video. If there's any way you can support us, even if it is transcribing this message so that I can post the transcript uh, on YouTube, please, I will sincerely appreciate it. A sister from um, Netherlands did that some time ago, but I don't think she has the time now. If you have the time, please contact me. Any way you can support us, your financial support, your encouragement, your prayers, uh, even equipment, whatsoever way you can support us, I will sincerely appreciate it. Our contacts are in the description box, and any way you can support us, please do where to do so. And also, I want to appreciate those who have been supporting this ministry. God bless you. Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel and our other channels across social media platforms. Eagle Eye Opener. If you have any question, please, yeah, you will not be allowed to comment on YouTube. You can email me. My contact details are on the screen. God bless you. Bye-bye.